The city is saving a bit of money this year, and it's all thanks to the weather. Meteorologist Leanne Oakley joins us now with more on how that's happening. Well, thanks, Heather. Now, we've heard some reports from around the state that salt reserves are really high right now, and it's all because of the mild winter. Mild, we're getting rain right now, even. Now, some of the places that have a really high surplus are Lafayette and West Lafayette. So, we checked here at the Fort Wayne Street Department to see how they're doing. We'll take a look behind me right now. This is one of the several salt reserves that the city has on hand right now. These barns are still rather full, and that's all due to the lack of snow so far this winter. As of today, we've only had 16.6 seven inches of snow for the season. That's just over nine inches below average and more than 14 inches less than this point last year. I talked with Frank Suarez today from Public Works and he says that our salt reserve is only slightly higher than where they expected and that's all because the amount of snow isn't the only factor. It's not always about big snowfalls because sometimes it could be a, a small snow that's maybe just two inches but it lasts for 10 hours and that means that we have to go and salt in those intersections three or four times a day. So it depends on the rate that it comes down and also the amount. And certainly ice can contribute to that as well. Now, last winter, Fort Wayne saw right near the average amount of snow, so there was some salt left over for this year. This will help the city save money for next year as well. Now, coming up at 6, I'll take a clo little bit closer look as to exactly how much the city thinks it's been saving on buying salt, not only for this year, but possibly for next year. Reporting live from the Fort Wayne Street Department, Leanne Oakley, News Channel 15.